Let's break them though down into two main groups. You have your moderate and you have your radicalized. And of course, our government and I think other European governments want to believe that the moderate version of Islam, the academic version of Islam, is the true Islam. Those of us who've read the biography of Muhammad, have read the Quran, we know that's probably not the case. It is most likely, and I'm almost convinced of it, that if you follow the life of Muhammad, without a doubt, ISIS is actually a natural um, result of following the Sirah of the Prophet and also of following some of the verses of the Quran.